I'm Karen Brooks Nelson, the Educational Technology Consultant from Advanced Education. I'm working with a Hitachi interactive projector and a whiteboard, and in this video I'm going to show you just some of the features of the menu. And I have uh, Starboard software open, and you can see the menu here, but it's rather small. I am going to make it larger so that you can see it better. To do that, I'm going to the settings at the top and choosing the preferences. And on the middle tab, the toolbar tab, you'll see that I can make it small, medium, or large. And I am going to make it large by checking in that little radio button and then clicking OK. So now we've got a menu that you can see better. Now the first thing you might want to do is just write on your surface. So I'm going to choose the pen and I can write hello and I can change the color by clicking on blue now and how are you and that should be a question so I want to change that I'm going to find my eraser and the eraser is down here on the left hand side and I'm going to now erase that and go back to the pen and the blue and change it to a question mark now it's kind of fun to get rid of this really quickly rather than trying to erase the whole thing. If you click on the IntelliPen here, make a big X through everything, it'll take it off. So I'll do that again. I'm going to make an X on the question mark and it'll be gone. So this IntelliPen is good for more than that. It's really good for math. So if I draw a circle and it's not perfect, let's do that again it'll straighten it out. So my first one probably wasn't touching. Let's try that. There we go. So it'll fill them out. Now, we also have, as well as the IntelliPen that's able to make the shapes perfect, we have shapes that are pre-made. But before I show you that, I really want to add a new page. So let's look up here. This two-page icon with the drop-down arrow will give us a new page, but it doesn't mean that your other page is gone. It's just on a different page. So we'll go back on the navigation icon, and we can see our page once more. And I can go forward on the forward navigation button to get to my new page. So let's look at the shapes now. There are lines, arrows, circles, ellipses, triangles. Let's do a right angle triangle. or several right angle triangles. Let's change to blue and do some rectangles. Looks like a piece of modern art, doesn't it? Now I'm going to fill them. So what I want to do for that is go to the paint bucket here. Click on the paint bucket and choose a color. And just click inside. Let's change to pink, etc. So we have looked at the pen the IntelliPen, the colors, the paint bucket, the eraser and shapes, and we've looked at adding a page and navigating through our file. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you'll come back and see more of our videos on the website.